What's up, everybody? Jason here from jazbeescasebreaks.com. It is new release day. Happy Bowman Baseball Day. There's a lot of new releases today as well besides Bowman, but Bowman is by far the biggest. We have Mosaic Basketball today. That'll be on personals on jazbeescasebreaks.com. And then, of course, we have Select Baseball as well. But again, happy Bowman Day. Uh, we're starting off early today, uh, 6.30 a.m. Pacific here in Los Angeles. So we're going 24 hours today, guys. So I don't know if you guys have seen our website but as you can see, our first ever 24-hour live stream, starting with me, Andy and Nick, at 6 in the morning on Saturday. Should be really, really fun, guys. So again, for everybody that is watching, if you're uh, in the chat, I've been dropping this link out for our show notes, for anybody that's new here. Our, our breaking schedule, we break seven days a week. Our times, uh, Bowman, uh, of course, break schedule for the day. So everything is there in the show notes. So I copied and pasted that link into the chat. So now let's start off with Bowman. 2020 Bowman Jumbo 8-box case break. Random teams number one. It's 26 total spots. There's four combo teams, as you can see they're right here in the item uh, description. D-backs Cardinals, Phillies Twins, Pirates Mariners, Giants Rockies. And again, this is an early bird, so an opportunity to win a free spot if you bought one of the first 16 in the break. Just remember, no paper-based ships. Uh, I think the only two players that we are shipping, I believe, is uh, Dominguez and... Um, the other guy on the Kansas City Royals. But all chrome cards will ship, numbered cards, inserts, short prints, and hits will ship. And then all paper base is sold by us, and then we donate it 100% to the sale of charity, which we have been uh, for the last couple years. So here you go, guys. Yeah, Bobby Witt, there it is. He's right here on the front page. All right, so dice roller here, customer names. Zachary down to Matthew. This is for the early bird randomizer, first 16. This is everybody else in the break. Um... We had a couple people get refund on numbers one and two, so it kind of messed up the list, but we fixed it all last night. I believe one customer was left out, but I think we already emailed you. Everything's good. Uh, so here you go. Here's the final list. And then again, we're going to give away one free spot uh, to the early bird winner. And then here are the list of teams with the combo teams. So good luck. Let's roll the dice. And we got a one and a six, or one and a five, six times. So number one gets a free spot in this break. Good luck. One. Two. Three, four, five, and six. Boom, six times. Five and a one, six. Zachary, congratulations. You just won a free spot in this break of Bowman Random Team Jumbo number one. So let's throw you in here. Give you a little plus sign. Now let's go six times here now on the list of teams and uh, names. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Six times, Matthew, down to Matthew at the bottom. What's going on, Joshua? Good morning, man. All right, six times here now on the teams. Good luck, everybody. There's the combo teams. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Six times. Padres down to the Chicago White Sox. So Matthew, you got the San Diego Padres. Rob with the Texas Rangers. Matthew with the Mets. Joshua. You have the Detroit Tigers. Charles with the Rockies Giants combo. Michael Kuntz with the Indians last one mojo. Zachary with the Angels. Matthew, you have the Royals. Chad with the Astros. Zachary with the Nationals. Uh, Matthew S. with the Dodgers. Dennis, you have the Blue Jays. Chad with the Braves. Josh Pruce, you have the Cubs. Rick with the Brewers. Zachary with your free spot Orioles. <clears throat> Kevin with the Marlins. Matthew with the Reds. Matthew Gomes, that is. Matthew S. with the Oakland A's. Uh, Charles, you have the Red Sox, and Arthur Peru, man, what a lucky guy, getting himself the Yankees, one spot mojo in it, congratulations Arthur, let's see if we can pull you fire, Jason, you got the D-backs Cardinals, Brian with the Rays, Matthew with the Pirates Mariners, Combo Rich, you got the Twins Phillies, and Matthew with the Chicago White Sox, so I'll give you guys a quick minute to trade, uh, in the meantime though, I'm going to just start ripping open these boxes, and I'm going to turn on Nick Cam here on the main page, so that way you guys can see, but I will allow trades and I'll leave it open for a couple minutes. I know this is a big, big type of break, of course. So here's Nick Cam. Uh, should be good right there. 
Now I'm just gonna quickly start ripping this open. Um, well, pretty much, Jays. I mean, we won't have Mosaic Basketball on the website today. We'll have them for personals on jazbees.com. So, all the show notes and everybody what everybody needs to know for the day is going to be here. But, yeah, it's pretty much just baseball. It's a bigger baseball release than basketball. You know, you got Bowman Baseball that's going to rule. You got Select Baseball. Pretty much everything on the website uh, that is baseball, Bowman, and Select is going to break today. I don't think we'll have any Mosaic breaks up today and tomorrow. Probably not to the Sunday, Monday, if we have any. Um, I know we have them for personals. So again, uh, fast break and everything that's sold, that's sold, uh, releasing today should be on with Teddy later today at 3 o'clock on jazbees.com on Instagram. So. Alright guys, well, I don't think anybody's going to want to trade, Matt. I don't even know if Archer's watching. I know D-backs Cardinals combo was up for trade from Jason, so I think I'm just going to have to close it. And again, once I say the trade window's closed, they just close, guys. No trades after. So this is the last call. Going once. Well, just remember, Jason, I'm assuming you're Jason Dvax Cardinals owner. Uh, you do any money transactions, it's not going to go with us. I mean, so for some reason, we don't really do that. So just a little FYI. You guys work out your money transactions on your own, but we will just allow the trade, but you guys do with the money transactions. Matthew, I'm going to close it, man. I'm going to close it. So, if you're going to reply back to him, do it now. Alright. Try to close them, guys. And TWC is trade window closed. No problem, man. Good luck, everybody. Stick with what you got, then. You never know. All right. I have been ripping. Good luck. Bowman's first autograph of Jackson Rutledge. Washington Nationals. Give me one second, guys, and put this up here. Forgot to show the final printout.
Don't worry, Eddie. I got this, man. I'm built for this. This is what I'm built for. I don't need to worry about that. We got a Jason Dominguez already. A Bowman Chrome base. I don't know what this is going to sell for, but of course, anything of this kit is just super hot. We got Seth Beer for the Diamondbacks to 125. Anthony K to 499. Really love the new design. It's just very crisp and clear. I like it. Uh, Matthew Barzell, yeah. Pretty good, man. Luis Garcia, paper to two ninety Dylan Cease. You're like, damn, I need to just buy something, though, right? You're just like, can't walk out of here empty-handed. This is a Jason Dominguez paper. And a Christian Pash. Pache. To four ninety nine and Sheridan Apostle to four ninety nine Bones first for Texas. Rob with that one, Rob Hepler. Sort of. 
And a Brennan McKay rookie autograph, rookie of the year favorites to 150. Tampa Bay Rays. Uh, TB is Brian Rose. Jason Dominguez, Bowman Scouts, top 100. He's number 53. Well, I guess because he's like 17. Is that maybe why? Thought he'd be like number one. All right, next box, guys. That was one jumbo. First Chrome. And a uh, Genrod. Or Genard, sorry. It's a 250 for the Mets. Bowman's first purple. It's a 250. Genard. Start top loading the autos to get those separated. A lot of color to start off, right? I just want to pull Super Fractor day one. I mean, I I hardly ever pull Super, super Fractors, especially in group breaks. They're so tough, but I mean, I pulled the Vlad Super Fractor for a personal box the other day from Bowman Chrome, and it just got me so hyped that like that Super kind of Fractor, even though it was a non-auto, was sitting in a Bowman Chrome box for you know nearly over a year. Right? Which is pretty crazy. And that's why I always believe that, you know, there's always still some stuff hiding in boxes, even though we don't see them. Cardenas, Bowman's first for the Rays. paper and we got a Luis Jill a little sparkle to two ninety nine <laughs> this is this is a rerun this is your dreaming deporter you're dreaming buddy this isn't a rerun this isn't even real life this is a uh, this is all in a dream. All right, let's finish up the second half of the second box. And Miguel Vargas, Bowman's first to two ninety nine. Yeah, go back to bed, Deep Porter. <laughs> 
When you wake up, I won't be here. Or I will be here. I don't know. Will I? <laughs> Dodgers. Uh, Matthew. Exactly, yeah. Inception. Dream within a dream. Honestly, guys, I couldn't really get much sleep yesterday. I was so hyped last night. I just, I really, I probably only got like maybe three and a half hours of sleep, maybe four. You know, you get used to just breaking late, guys, you know, and it's just, it's so hard to try to go to sleep early for a change. You know, I was probably in bed by 10 o'clock yesterday. My goal was like to be in bed at 10 and try to fall asleep by 11. But that, that didn't happen. Nick Allen. Yeah, and the one thing about Bowman Baseball this year is that you got rookie autographs in Bowman Baseball, which usually they save them for like... I mean, not that they don't save them for the first one, because I'm lying, actually. You know, there's usually not many rookies, but imagine you're going to get, like, even have a chance at, like, Bo Bichette rookies, Alvarez. Like, all the big names, I think, are in this checklist. When usually, I think they save them, don't they? I don't know. I feel like they do. Maybe it's just, maybe I'm just tripping out. Oh, you got an orange checkerboard Crosby? Very nice, Joe. No problem, man. No, there's a little whole mix up and whatnot, but I'm glad it all worked out on me finally. I was able to get those out to you. I remember we were also waiting on some more because I think we got some more cup hockey in and we had to order more. More OPG Platinum. Caramel macchiatos at ice caramel macchiatos at Starbucks, guys. There's just something else, man. It just hits different early in the morning, doesn't it? Now I understand why people love Starbucks in the morning. It just hits different. Yeah, well, yeah, exactly. Like it's really tough to get the rookie autographs, but when you do, right? crazy yeah and I'm glad it worked out you got a nice little uh, nice little Crosby tractor board man oh PG Clown this year guys is just so beautiful I know it's a baseball break guys but not that I don't love Bowman right now but if you're watching this video talking to a customer but PG Clown is like the Bowman tops chrome of hockey it's just beautiful stuff kind of funny that I feel like I've seen Luis Robert prospect non-rookie base and I've also seen rookies yeah no it's you know what I think out of all this quarantine and COVID I think hockey has been affected the most honestly I don't know why maybe is it just Canadians don't want to buy right now because there's no hockey I don't know maybe they're sad I, I mean honestly though because even McDavid stuff has gone down Big time, which I'm hoping that guys. I don't know if you guys seen, but the 
RPA 97 out of 99 pulled in Cup last year in December is up for auction at Leland. But I feel like out of all the sports, hockey has been the most effective when it comes to prices. So right now is a perfect time to buy because a lot of prices went down. Oh, is that why, Rich? That makes sense. But yeah, I feel like hockey has been the most effective when it comes to pricing. I feel like football has just skyrocketed. Basketball is just because of the loaded rookie class, but I mean, baseball has been doing well still. It's just really been hockey that kind of like has uh, has really slowed down. So definitely, if you're in the States, it's a perfect time to buy up some hockey. And we got uh, Pad Linney, Steven, uh, for the Atlanta Braves. Chad with that one. Jason Dominguez. So, like, what is a paper of Jason Dominguez going to sell for? I know the paper of Bowman's first was going for like crazy, but I get it because it's like a Bowman's first edition. Like, and when I mean that's like the you know what I'm talking about, not Bowman's first, but Bowman's first. Yes, <laughs> they kind of like messed. Not that they messed everything up, but they with that little extra that they made with the stamp on it. See, look at this is a Reese Robert, like a prospect, without, without the RC, and then there's a version with the RC. Kind of funny. Yeah, well, yeah, the first the first edition, I know they were as high as 200. I feel like now with Bowman baseball, they're kind of gonna drop a little bit. So I'd say, yeah, I kind of be in your range, Ryan. Obviously, try to still get the most, but I feel like paper in general, just from this class, is probably gonna be. Uh, probably going to be like 50 bucks maybe I'd say right because trust me there's going to be a lot of Jason Dominguez paper we're going to pull out of here so obviously in random teams it's such a crazy it's such a crazy um, crazy thing because think about it let's say you get like 10 paper base of, of Jason Dominguez right let's just say I know that sounds like a lot but we've probably already gotten like 3 of them already and we're barely in the first 3 boxes let's say you get like close to 10 I mean, if they're going to sell for 30 bucks, that's already a 300 bucks right then and there, right? So, obviously, right now is the time to capitalize and sell them as we're first, you know, Bowman's first days and stuff like that. First week of Bowman, but eventually, I think the paper base is going to drop just a little bit. What they're going to start doing, though, of course, is they're going to start grading it. And, you know, you get a paper base graded PSA 10, of course, that's going to sell for a lot more, right? But let's just think about it like it's crazy. I was saying, like, you know, the, the Yankees in our picky teams were, what, 1500 bucks. It's a very hefty price. But if you really think about it, if you get X amount of paper base, a couple chromes, and even just a base auto, I think the base autos are just going to go for, like, 700 bucks, no minimum at least. So, you know, you get that. I mean, you're pretty much breaking even. So what you really have to hope for, of course, is just a color. You know, you get a color Dominguez, that's it. It's over, right? <laughs> That's that's the crazy thing. So of course, if you have the fifteen hundred dollars, definitely, I'm sure a lot of us would, but not everybody has fifteen hundred dollars laying around. But I think random teams was definitely the way to go, at least to give you a shot. Bryce Ball for the Braves. Yeah, that's true. Jason Dominguez Chrome. 
We got Owen Miller for San Diego. A little like Aqua Shimmer. And Xavier Edwards to two ninety nine. Padres. Matthew. There you go. Bowman's first. What's up, Trey? You prayed for my fingers today? Thank you. Although I don't need it, man. I keep on telling people I'm built for this. This is this is the one day out of the year, the one weekend out of the year. I'm just, I just turn it on, you know. I'm just like it don't matter. I'll feel, I'll feel the soreness later in the week. Once my adrenaline has kind of fallen down, I'll be good though, man. I love breaks like this. Uh, Tim Anderson, yellow paper to seventy five. And Will Wilson to one or two twenty five or one twenty five, sorry. And a Jeremy Benya. Houston Astros. Bowman's first to ninety nine or four ninety nine refractor. Houston Astros going to Chad Wright. Got a lot of race stuff so far. Ford Proctor. I actually didn't really study the checklist this time. Morgan Harris for the Oakland Athletics. Matthew S. Also, you know what's crazy? I'm just thinking about it right now. Matt Gomes, I don't even think you had the Oakland Athletics. It was Matthew S. <laughs> so that would have been kind of crazy. I would have realized that right now you wouldn't have been able to trade.
if I already got him the three autographs out of these boxes, but. All right, next one. Yeah, I'm pretty much on track to get these breaks done within an hour. I'm at, I think, 36 minutes recording, although it took me about, like, you know, a couple, like, four or five minutes to do the randomizer and stuff like that. So, when we definitely do picker teams of hobby or jumbo, I'll probably be able to save about five, ten minutes. So like I said, the break schedule is in the show notes. Uh, let me drop the link again for you guys. Uh, so that way you guys can check that out. Um, I'll probably be doing everything on the list so far. I'll probably be able to do Pikachu number 3-2 before Joe gets here. So I'll be able to kill off 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 cases. And then Joe will hop on. Um, and he'll be on till 10, and then of course, like he's Nick, he'll do 10 to 6 a.m. So definitely Nick right now is resting, I'm pretty sure. Although, I don't know, he's a Nighthawk too. He stays up pretty late. Oh, is that right? Well, I guess there's always another. There's always other Bowmans first that they don't put out in previous years, so they can always have some like rollovers, right? But maybe, yeah, maybe if that's if it's just because it's only five rounds, then maybe the checklist is much smaller. That Bowman draft won't drop hard for like Christmas time. That'll be another big release. Man, I'm looking at the clock right here on the computer, guys, and it's just funny. It's like, it says 7 11, and I'm thinking right now, oh, it's 7 o'clock at night right now. Like, the sun's barely going down. No, we're live 7 a.m. PT. I don't think so, Mike. I mean, I'll probably, I think, obviously, that me and Nick are a little bit quicker than Joe, but that's also just because, you know, Joe, uh, ooh, Gavin Lux rookie auto. How about that? Very nice for the Dodgers. Matthew S. Uh, you know, because he likes to take a little bit of his time. Obviously chatting with you guys, but I think we'll pretty much all do around the same five to six cases. If, if one does a little bit better, it's just gonna be like one case. 
Which, think about it. If we can all do five to six cases, that means that we're going to get... Ooh, what's going on here? Nice. CJ Abrams to 75. Man, that looks great. Um, so, if we could do that, we'll do like 15 cases in one 24-hour shift. And then I'll be back again tomorrow morning, probably like around 10, 10 a.m. or so. And I'll do a couple more cases in the morning before Joe gets here, so... I think if anything, even though we don't talk about it much, we're all probably just going to compete on who pulls Dominguez and Bobby Witt autographs the most. Or who pulls the best. More than just time of breaks. Davis for the Cubs. Uh, well, that's another thing to be determined, William. Um, we have a lot scheduled to come today. You know, it says to be delivered today, but again, we've had that happen already so far. Ooh, a little Atomic favorites, AJ Puck. So we're, we're hoping that we'll be able to get the majority of our stuff today, but that's still to be determined. But we have, I think we have a little bit though today though that we, we that we got yesterday, so. I think for sure we'll still be able to do pretty much all the breaks today that sell out. But of course, to be determined anything after, I don't know. That all just depends if the shipment gets here today. Ooh, Oscar Gonzalez first to 50 for the Cleveland Indians. That's our first gold. Michael Coons, last spot mojo. So yeah, I mean, if our stuff does get delivered today, then we'll have everything for the whole weekend. If not, then we might have to wait for some cases tomorrow if we don't have enough today. And then hopefully tomorrow gets delivered in the morning so we can start at 10 o'clock. Dominguez. JJ Blade. It's 150 shimmer for the Miami Marlins. Cruz to four ninety nine paper. Uh, well, there's quite a few. I mean, I don't know so much, um, but I mean, obviously, Bobby Witt would probably be the second best, right, with the Kansas City Royals. Oakland Athletics were a pretty pricey picker team. Um, and then, of course, you still have the rookies in here too. But obviously, definitely the Yankees are in their own category. And I'm sure, yeah, Rich says Rangers. There's a lot of teams that were kind of in the same price range, for sure. But obviously, the Yankees are in their own category. Yeah, Rick saying A's, Red Sox. And Scooball to 150, Detroit Tigers. That's Joshua. That one, Joshua G. I'm sure the Dodgers are still pretty priced a little pricey of course with luck uh, lux autograph opportunities rookies and then 
their farm system has always been pretty solid. So I'm sure they're kind of a little pricey too. So there's probably a good handful, like 10 teams maybe. And we got a Yankee autograph. Cannon Smith to 499. Definitely trying to get some Jason Dominguez for Arthur, but so far though, Arthur. You've gotten a lot of paper and chrome of Jason Dominguez, so I think uh, I think you'll make a good amount back with just that. So, but hoping of course for an autograph, man. We got a Nolan Gar a Gorman to one fifty for the Cardinals, and Kettle Marte to seventy five for the Diamondbacks. Speaking of Jason Dominguez, there he is again. Brady Singer to Yeah, that's what I was saying. I mean, they're going to drop down just a little bit. Sam Huff for the Rangers. And, of course, after so many of them are on eBay and so many of them sold. So, I don't think it's going to be crazy to see them drop to, like, 20 bucks, Maybe 25 Maybe a little less. But, I mean, even then, that adds up. Right? But even right now, if you can get rid... You can sell them for 50 bucks at paper base. Right? I mean, you're, you're going to get a good return back in. And that's not even including the chromes. Right? So definitely it's going to add up. So necessarily in a random teams, if you get one spot, you don't really have to hit an autograph. You could just get all the paper and all the chromes. And you'll pretty much make all your money back and make some on the side. But of course, you get an autograph and a color card. You're crazy. You're golden. Luis Robert to 250. That's a prospect paper. Of course, you have rookies in here as well of him. Sicto Sanchez. guys we're done our last two boxes again guys next one coming up is Bowman random team jumbo number two and after that jumbo pick your team one two hobby random team one and then of course I should end off with pick your team number three of Bowman and that should pretty much be my day and then Joe will hop on from around 2-ish to 10. And then, of course, Nick will take over from like 10 to 6. And then back again on Saturday. That was 3. I'll do about 4 hours before Joe gets here. Joe will do his normal Nick at night. And then I'll be back again Sunday, Monday from 2 to 12. So, a lot of breaking over the weekend, guys. And that's obviously just because we know that these are pretty much time-consuming breaks, so try to get out as much as we can. And I know we're going to put a little, like, a, 
public service announcement out there. But just remember, guys, we're going to try to sort this out as quick as possible. But just know that it's going to take us an extra couple business days. So, you know, it's going to take us probably about four to five days to get this out. So, obviously, don't expect this to go out, like, you know, Monday or something like that, you know. Of course, if you get some big hits and you want to expedite the shipping, then we can expedite just the cards. But obviously, the chrome and base and everything like that, we'll have to wait until we sort it out. But, you know, if you get a big Dominguez hit or something, you can always pay for the quicker shipping. We can get that card out. But everything else will have to be sorted out separately. But we're going to try our best to get it out as quick as possible. Especially with the volume of cases we're going to do today, tomorrow, Sunday, Monday. I mean, we're probably going to get through like, if we have the cases here, we're going to we're gonna get through like 20 plus cases. So, I'm sure we're going to public service announcements everywhere, but I know there's going to be one person that says, Hey, I haven't got my Bowman cards that broke on Sunday, and it's like Tuesday. You know, it's just like, everybody knows Bowman's crazy, so... And I think we have pretty quick shipping time, to be honest. I know there's some places that take over a week to ship, and it's like a normal for them. So who here has a day off today? Who's, who's gonna who's gonna attempt to watch our stream for twenty four hours? That's my question. Who took a day off today and deemed it a national holiday? <laughs> yeah, that's horrible, Trey. Because that's not your fault, right? I mean, we ship out in a timely manner. Ooh, that's a little Chrome Dominguez here. But, you know, we ship out between three business days, three to four, right? So, breaks from, like, Thursday go out, like, Tuesday for most of the time, right? So, that's what, Friday's a business day, Monday's a business day, and it's out Tuesday. But, you know, however long it takes to get to you guys after we drop it off or they pick up, it's that's totally up to them. Oh, that's true, Trey. You're, you're correct, Amundo. Every day is a day off when you love what you do. Jamie says, well, tonight was supposed to be my rehearsal dinner, but I'm enjoying this. It take Oh, nice, man. It's... So are you tying the knot, Jamie? Is that what's happening here? I'm assuming that's what your rehearsal dinner means. Unless it's... Something else. Aaron Shortridge. I guess it could be. Oh, sorry, I read your text wrong. Tonight was supposed to be. You're right, you're right. But due to COVID, had to move to Denver. All right. Gotcha, man. Well, congratulations, man. My wedding experience was pretty hectic. There was a lot of things that I feel like the guests never see. Right? There's always things that go wrong on your wedding day. You know, that me and my wife like had to go through. But... But everybody else that's attending the party, right, it's just like, they don't see it. Gold Shimmer, Proctor. But it ends up being one of the most hectic days, but one of the most memorable ones. Once you, uh, once pretty much you're already in the hall, you know, you already eat dinner, you already ate dinner, you do the, your first dances, and it's just pretty much party time until the end of that.
You got a Tatis uh, home run challenge card from Tots one more pack. Nice. How do those really work, right? You just gotta you put in your number of what they you think they're gonna hit, and then if it happens, you win something. Or does the code have a certain number for you already? And if your code wins, then you get something. Sam Huff. And we got Luis Garcia, gold chrome. What's up, Chris? How's it going? I know, man. I can't believe it. I can't believe we're already going to be in June. I mean, we're like on May 22nd already. It's crazy. Although it's felt like it's been forever. This, this COVID. You know what, Rich? I was just gonna. It's kind of funny since you guys are in the mind. I was actually just about to say that when I saw that there was another Huff or Rangers. I feel like there's been a lot of the same team, same players in this case, which, yeah, it makes me to believe that there's gonna be some cases that are just freaking loaded for the Yankees. Damn, Rex, how much blasters did you buy? What you buy over there, Rex? I feel like you got a whole. Whole mixer full of stuff over there at Walmart. <laughs> All right, guys, this is the last box as well. I've already started digging into this one. Quinn Cotton to four ninety nine for the Reds. And I'll do a little autograph hit recap as well at the end of the break. And go through some of these. Merrifield Ashby uh, for the Milwaukee Brewers. It's going to Rick K. Dominguez. Is that right, Jamie? That's awesome. Have my wedding at the link when I renew my vows? That'd be awesome. They're waiving uh, wedding fees. Ooh, and a Dustin May rookie gold. Or sorry, this is not probably gold. Well, it's a gold, but 
whatever they call this version. I got a 75. Nice break for the Dodgers. Two rookies for the Dodgers in this break. Dustin May and a rookie base of Gavin Lux. Gray for the Dodgers. So how much would that cost? I mean, I'm assuming that's still a little pricey, right, Jamie? Even if they waive the fees. I mean, we're talking the link here, right? So you got to assume the food's going to be pretty pricey and the adult beverages. But of course, you know, waiving the wedding fee to host it there, I guess it's, pretty, it's a pretty good deal, right? So is, is that what you rescheduled it at, Jamie? Man, I better be getting a, an RSVP. Gives me a reason to go to Philadelphia in, in September. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. There you go. First... Bowman, baseball, break in the books. So I pretty much got this done in about 50 minutes. 55 minutes to be exact. So not too bad, not too shabby. So again, we'll do a little quick recap. These are just paper base of players, some color cards, of course. Right, Dominguez paper, chrome, Dominguez paper, chrome. So it's all gonna add up, guys. For whoever gets the Yankees, of course, you're gonna get a handful of them, which ends up being a sweet deal. I may have top loaded a couple of the Dominguez cards, but these will all be top loaded and they'll be safe. And it's like a little Bowman Scouts Dominguez. No autographs, unfortunately, but still, the paper and the chrome will definitely add up. All right, so here you go. Dustin May, Ashby. Uh, you got Cotton, Huff, Proctor, Shortridge, Dominguez, Huff, Smith, Scooball. Oh, so I don't know why that was there. Gonzalez, Davis, Lux Rookie, Harris, Proctor, Benya, Edwards, Ball, uh, Paulini, Vargas, Cardenas, Dominguez, Chrome, Brennan McKay to 150. Uh, Genord, Apostle, Rutledge. So there you go. There were the autographs for the break. Again, this was Bowman, Jumbo, Random Team, number one on jazbeescasebreaks.com. Coming up next, Random Team number two.